<clears throat> what's up, my boy? What's popping? You need some tickets to what show or what? All you got to do is get at the homies. Get at the homies from the hood. Ask them. I know you got Kato's number. Hit Kato up. <clears throat> we got to listen to some motherfucking corridos one time. <coughs> Let's go play some of these motherfucking corridos. What corrido you guys want to listen to while I smoke this shit? You guys got to tell me. I listen to this corrido all the time. This one right here, man. That shit turns me over. I don't know if any of you guys heard this shit right here, but if you have... Let me know, cuz. I know we probably be listening to the same shit. What's up, Leslie? How you doing? Hey, what's, what city you guys want me to visit this time around? You guys gotta let me know. Smoking on this motherfucking weed. What's poppin', bro? What's good? How you doing? What's up, dude? Say, what's up? Come inside. Oh, <laughs> it's cracking my voice. Hell yeah. Hey, you, you, got, you got some samples? Come on, my dude. Oh, hell yeah. We about to show the fans. Hey, I'm about to show you guys something that my boy just did right now for me. Check it out. So I'm gonna I'm give these away for free to all of the fans that got a VIP on Thursday and shit. So check them out. So check this out. We're not gonna be selling these. These are just gonna be gifts away for the fans and shit. Hopefully you guys like them. On one side I got this. You could give them away to somebody. You know what I'm saying? You could write on them. You could do some whatever you want. <laughs> and those I, are the version two. Yeah, yeah. So look, we we got one version of these. So some of you are gonna get some of these. Some of you are gonna get uh, different colors. You feel me? But right now, that's what we're working on. We're gonna be coming up with different colors and different shit. See you guys on Thursday. Everybody keeps asking me, are we gonna be able to smoke weed? Hell yeah, we're gonna be able to smoke weed. You wanna smoke? Yeah, come on. Take a seat right here, bro. You just got off of work or what? Shop right now. Oh, yeah? What's up, Roxy? I see you just watching right now. What's up with you? <laughs> Yeah, I'm going to try to get about 200 of them so I could give them away, you know what I'm saying? To people that come to the show. By the way, we only have 100, ticket le uh, 100 tickets left for the show on Thursday. And um, it's, it's, I think the venue's for 1,000 people. So I suggest if you guys, you know what I'm saying, if you guys were planning on going to the show, go to the website right now. You know what I'm saying? Grab the tickets because they're about to be gone. Hopefully I get to see everybody. Um... At the end of the show, I'm randomly going to select fans that I could just take to the back and, you know what I'm saying, uh, take some pictures with. Uh, hopefully, I get to see a lot of my young fans, too, because a lot of you guys send me messages. You want advice about life. And, you know what I'm saying, I want to give you that love, and I want to be able to tell you, you know what I'm saying, just guide you in the right direction and shit, because one thing I'm never going to tell you is to go do some reckless shit or, or, you know, go prove yourself to people that you don't need to prove yourself to. I, I want to give you guys good advice. I want to tell you things like... You know what I'm saying? I, there, there's a bigger picture, you know what I'm saying? 
There's a lot of money out there to be made. You guys just gotta motivate yourself. Don't let people tell you any fucking different. If you got an idea and you wanna come up with a certain brand or certain shit you wanna do, I suggest you do it. You feel me? Don't don't wait for fucking opinions, cause shit, when I started rapping, not everybody was saying, oh, this shit is dope. You feel me? Some people didn't like it, but at the end of the day, you gotta continue on doing what you want. Spark a motherfucking blunt if you agree with me. Straight up. You wanna hit this? Let's give some shout outs to some of my fans in here. What's good? Shout out to my boy Troops Medina. What's up, Troops? What's poppin', Miguel? What's good, homie? I'm going to Boise, Idaho in a couple of months. See, if you go on my page, there's going to be a section where you, you, you're able to see all the tour dates that I'm going to go on. So all you got to do is just go on there. What's up, Joanna? What's popping? You good? Damn, my boy said he don't want to smoke none of this no more. This shit is loud. <laughs> What's up, G? What's cracking, man? We posted up, man. Yeah. We're smoking, chilling. Yeah. Making motherfucking money. Hey, I'm trying hey, to tell. I'm trying to tell. Too. I'm trying to tell the fans. You know, the young fans. They always ask me for advice, bro. Mm -hmm. They're always telling me. You know, what I'm saying, what advice would I give them so they can, you know, what I'm saying, grow up to be somebody important or grow up to be somebody that makes money. You know, yeah, what I'm saying, yeah. they always asking me. Yeah, you yeah. know, we grew up hard, bro. Yeah. You know, Same we grew city, up hard. Southgate. Southgate in the motherfucking building. Shout out to everybody in Southgate. I grew up in Inglewood too. Shout out to Boyle all Heights. my people in Inglewood. Boyle Heights. Boyle Heights. Yeah. Shout out to Boyle Heights. If anybody's on here watching from Boyle Heights, what's Boyle up? Boyle. They got the bombest tacos over there, by the way. <laughs> what's crazy is that. The, the the key is being loyal and being legit. Yeah. When I met this cat, I met him at the barber shop. First time I met Kimo G, met him at the barber shop, and ever since we've been like solid 100. You know what I mean? Like always repping my brand, Ill Skills Clothing, and we just been legit. You know, just being <clears throat> strictly loyal. Hell yeah, you gotta be loyal to people you motherfucking do business with. I always tell people something all the time. There's no way that you could be successful if you're not a loyal person, you feel me? Because you can't burn bridges with people. You can't be stepping on people's toes either. You can't be doing none of that shit. I be tripping out because a lot of people don't think that stepping on toes is a bad thing, bro. <laughs> That's crazy. That's some funny like, stuff. Like, like they forgot the rules to this shit, like yeah. the rules to the game, you know? You can't step on J's. Mm-mm. No way. Yeah, we coming to Idaho. Pull up. <laughs> Shout out to my boy, Tony G. What's up, Tony? Where the weed at? Yeah, we going to motherfucking... Um, if you want me to go to Wilmington, shout out to all my boys from Weed Miles over there. Um, you know what I'm saying? I suggest you pull up to the, to the Dub Show this weekend. By the way, I'm going to be giving away a gang of free shit to all my fans I see at the Dub Show, too. I haven't really been doing no free meet and greets and none of that shit. Don't think that I'm trying to switch up or nothing. You know what I'm saying? Because I still care about my fans. To me, money and this fame shit, that shit don't really matter. You know what I'm saying? I just take rap as my sport. I, I do it so I could be a voice as well, just so I could tell my story. Not so I could be a voice to people either. I just want to be a voice to myself and my family. I want to mind my business. I don't give a fuck what anybody got going on. Straight up. So when you guys send me messages asking me about other people, asking me about rappers, I don't care about none of that shit. None of it. Yeah. All I care about is family too. What you guys think about my new tattoo? See, this is family shit right here. My little daughter, Lexi, by the way. Hey, I wanted to I wanted to say this to all the homies that got daughters. You know, everybody always told me for years that uh, once you have a daughter, you know, you, 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 you change as a father. You know what I'm saying? It ain't the same like being a father to a son. A lot of the homies always tell me that a daughter really changes you. And, man, I could tell you, homie, I share that feeling now with you because now I'm starting to look at life a different way. I'm starting to look at women a different way, too. Mm. Straight up. I'm not thinking the same way. I'm now now my way of thinking with women is completely different. You know what I'm saying? 
Straight up. Women is a big distraction too. So all the, all the little homies out there, if all you want to do is chill with girls and chase girls, man, you're going to end up in a bad position. Straight up. Damn, I hit this real hard. Yeah, man, but back to chasing women and shit. You guys got to be on point. You guys can't be chasing women. You got to let the women chase you. You feel me? You got to be on the motherfucking grind. You just got to do your shit. Worry about you. That's all you got to do. Not nobody else. Hey, Cass. Yeah. Hey, can you do me a favor and, uh, and, and, uh, and, and grab some sticks from upstairs? Trying to light another one and shit. Like that. Yup. Yeah. Shout out to the Bay Area. Hell yeah, on this new album I'm about to drop. I give a shout out to the Bay Area. To the Raiders too. I say that me and the Raiders got something in common. Cause we both really from LA, but we be out in Vegas. You feel me? We belong to LA, but we be out in Vegas chilling. I swear, you guys are gonna love that shit. I got a song on there called Phone Taps. For anybody that's lived the street life, you understand. Phone Taps. It's a trippy situation when your phone starts getting staticky and shit and you think you're tripping. Nah, that shit's really going on. <laughs> Straight up. Better hang the fuck up and be like, what? Who are you calling for? Straight up. Yeah, I think we should give away some of these socks away to some of the people on Instagram right now. Yeah. Hey, we're going to give some socks away to anybody that tells me. To anybody that tells me. Uh, Crazy, right? How many total views do I have on my on my YouTube channel right now? If you give me the exact date, um, we're going to send you these socks. Shit. So you can fucking clean your house in them. If you're a girl, so you can clean your house in them. Just chill. Watch a movie and shit. Spark a blunt. Oh, shit. Check these out. Check these out. So look, I could, we could just give away some of these right here too. Right, yeah, we could give some away, some of these. Hey, tell people where, where they can find you and shit, or tell them a little bit about what you do, bro. Yeah. Because you make these right yeah, here. Yeah, I'm, right? I'm a designer and printer, so it's all in-house. Everything stays in-house. Hold on, yeah. hold on, hold on. We about to give you the plug right now. So this is the plug. Ill Meet skills the plug. clothing. Ill <laughs> skills clothing. Yeah, look my boy up. Mexicans, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. We Mexicans. We trying to get it. Yeah. Shout out to my boy. Shout out to anybody out there being Mexican trying to get it. That's what you guys got to do. Yeah. You got to connect dots. You got to make money together. You got to fucking do positive shit. Not none of that dumb shit. Because at some point, we become grown-ass men. Shit, now we grown-ass men. All I'm trying to do now is just... Post up and, and, and make sure I, I do shit for my family. That's what's important to me. Not the strip clubs. Remember when we used to hit the strip clubs? I don't know what is, <laughs> He's like, I don't I, know. I have, I have a girlfriend too, doggy. So no, I don't know what you're So talking you don't talk about, about the back? <laughs> we don't talk about Sam's, but Sam's. I don't ah, shit. Man. Hey, shout out to everybody over there at Sam's, man. Yeah. We save dollars. We don't throw dollars. Yeah. Hey, shout out to everybody on Southgate, though. I mean, in South, get on Tweety Boulevard. Tweety right Everybody there. that be going to Tweety, shout out to you, because you already know the Tweety Fair Wing be House. popping. Wing House. The Tweety Fair be popping. Shout out to my boy Grant and Wing House. Yeah, right? Yeah, shout out to Grant. All the barber What's shops up? right down Tweety. Uh, uh, shout out to fucking Coco Pelly Coco tattoos Pelly in this right motherfucker. Yeah. What's up? <laughs> Hell yeah. Shit. Right. That's why I got a gang of my tattoos. So if you guys want some tattoos, pull up over there with my people at Coco Pelly. They dope as fuck. Mm. They be showing mad love. On everything. I'm going to spark another one of these. Everybody's been asking me about these, too. Check this out. Watch. I'm going to show you what's in it. Hey, play a corrido you want to listen to. You listen to corridos, too, right? Come on. All day. Yeah, come on. You got you to gotta choose one and uh, introduce us to some shit. Maybe that we never heard. 
Which I doubt it because I heard everything. <laughs> On the hood. Damn, this shit almost caught on fire. Damn, what's up, Vanessa? How you doing? Vanessa B, what's good, Vanessa B? Cassie, you want to hit this? <clears throat> that shit's fucking ill, huh? Yeah. I'm trying to tell you. Hey, well, what's everybody, what's everybody planning on doing on motherfucking, uh, on Cinco de Mayo? What's everybody's plan? I want to know what, what city wants me to come through with the whole squad and... Watching another Mexican win that day. Yup. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's what you're doing? I'm gonna go to the fight. Oh, you're gonna go to the fight? Yeah. yeah. Who's he fighting? Triple G. He's fighting Triple G? Rematch. And, yeah. Oh, man. We gotta talk about that. Yeah. Canelo versus Triple G again. Yeah. yeah. Come out. It'll be another Mexican victory. Shout out to Canelo. You already know me, man. I'm Mexican, so I always go for our people. I support to the fullest. Uh, who do you guys think is going to win that motherfucking fight? Straight up. And who's going to get knocked out? Mm. I mean, Canelo got it to me, but, yep. you know, shit changes. And sometimes people get lucky. Sometimes people get lucky. They throw that motherfucking punch. Psst, man. La gente me critica porque ando tatuado. Ey, ey. Yeah. That's that new shit too that I'm about to drop. That's what he's playing up there. That shit sounds crazy. I'm gonna I'm put it on my live when that when they fight with Canelo and uh, Triple G. I'm gonna put that on my live so my fans that don't have nowhere to watch it, you guys can watch that shit with me, straight up. I'm gonna be on tour somewhere. I don't know where the fuck yet, yeah, but I'm gonna be on tour somewhere. Watching it. Hell yeah, I like this one. Hell yeah, dude. Tell me if you guys feel this one.